Hello, I am Mal, and welcome back to XCOM The Long War. Alright, so when we left off, we had a crash site, and we've also got a landing site. We're gonna go ahead and jump into this crash site. Oh yeah, destroyer, right. Okay, so I've got a beefier group put together. And I'm hoping it's gonna be strong enough. It should be. So, starting off on the left here, we've got uh, Johnny Kimball, aka Wirk. That's our Jaeger mech in the Mech 3 Valiant suit, so two secondary items, two small items, 12 defense, one damage reduction, two mobility bonus, and now has Jet Boot module built in, so that's kind of nice. Railgun, Grenade Launcher, Restorative Mist, Core Armoring, and a Scope. And a reminder, the build for the Jaeger mech starts with In the Zone, then I picked up Damn Good Ground and Executioner. Next, we've got our in the, uh, uh, excuse me, the in the zone sniper, Ulrich, Titan armor, plasma rifle, pistol sidearm, neural gun link, chameleon suit, and a side grenade. I actually think I'm going to change this side grenade. Uh, hmm. It's debating putting chitin plating on him. Now nah, I want the side grenade. We'll stick with that. Next, first of two snipers. This is our precision shot double tap sniper. Jamie Blacker, aka Jampot. Aegis armor, full sniper rifle, Gauss auto pistol sidearm, alloy bipod, illuminator gun sight, and a respirator implant because she does not yet have secondary heart. I gotta take care of that. Next, leading this will be Captain Caden Walker, aka Dragon, infantry officer. Titan armor, pulse rifle, pistol sidearm, a chem grenade, a med kit, and a scope. Next, we've got Mercs going as our in the zone sniper, Aegis armor, Gauss long rifle, auto pistol sidearm, neural gun link, alloy bipod, and high capacity mags. Delirium will be going as our rapid fire heat gunner, Titan armor, pulse auto blaster, shadow device, a scope, and a respirator implant. Stowe will be going as our psi operative and medic. Aegis armor, plasma storm gun, pistol sidearm, double set of med kits, and a respirator implant. And then last but not least, we've got Erica uh, going as our engineer, but really she's not going as our engineer. I know that sounds weird, but um, so this is something interesting I wanted to show you folks, and I, I don't think I've mentioned it before. Maybe I have. I, I don't know. I'm still a little bit suffering from the flu, and I'm on a lot of medication, so yeah. But let's take a look. What we've done with this engineer is we have essentially made a mini version uh, of the uh, gunner bullet wizard build. So, you know, I've got several gunners where their job is suppression, and when they suppress because of mayhem, they do damage, so then targets end up being hollow targeted and shredded, guaranteed. You can do that with an engineer. So, obviously, you start with grenadier, then you take hollow targeting. And then on this level, you can really choose whatever you want. Um, Ranger, uh, you could probably argue since it's a shooting, a shooty shooty type engineer that maybe Ranger would be better. I took smoke and mirrors for flexibility, but so hollow targeting, smoke and mirrors, suppression, and then mayhem. And you're like, well, wait a minute, Mal, where's the shredding stuff coming in? It's, it's, okay, hold on, hold on. Use this small item. Yep. So only assault and engineers can use it, so it works really well with this. You can get some nice synergy. So Titan armor, plasma carbine, laser pistol, shredder ammo, drum mags. It's gonna give her plus two ammo and base is five, so she'll get uh, two shreds, um, two suppressions, and then she'll still have enough ammo for another shot. And then obviously she'd have to reload on the following turn. But pretty cool, I think. I like. I, I want to try this out. And then for the last two, uh, let's see. Heat ammo? Yeah, yeah, that sounds good. So you could do some, uh, you could do, you could do some serious damage. I like that. I like that idea a lot. I mean, pack man. I mean, there's no bad choice on this level. Extra conditioning is real so good. Pack is so good. Heat ammo is so good. And then on the last level, I'm half tempted to actually take fire rocket. And you're like, what, man? That's crazy. Like, wait, hold on. Hear me out. Wouldn't it be kind of cool if you've got a suppressor type engineer, um, you know, using your small items to get that set up and have that work well for you, but then you've got fire rocket and then think about it. 
We get the blaster launchers later on, the homing seeking plasma based rocket, and then this person could carry it for you. That's kind of cool. I mean, I don't know. We'll see, but yeah, I got some different ideas in my head. Anyway, I think this group looks good. Uh, this destroyer crash site's probably going to be pretty nasty, so buckle in. Prepare for deployment. France is sending an urgent mission request. It looks like the aliens went down in a sparsely populated area. If there are civilians in the area, I hope they stay clear. Operation Hidden Mother. Mom! Mom! Mom, where are you? <laughs> I'm sorry. I crack myself up sometimes. Okay, let's see. Oh, where are you? Oh, you're over here. Okay. Approaching the crash site now. Strike team is awaiting your orders. Affirmative, Big Sky. Strike one is free to engage hostile targets at the crash site. Jet boot module activated. Heading to that location. Tell me that's not cool, right? Pretty neat. Let's see. This is. Uh, you are double tap. Okay, let's put you there. And snap at number two. Maybe uh, over this way. On the move. Think right there. All right, and then I'm on the move. move our engineer up. Will do. Gunner up. Put our medic back here. I know what you're thinking, like, why didn't I put the sniper here? Well, because there are some obstructions, these trees and stuff. I kind of want to have sight line down over here. Because this sniper will have... Actually, no. She will not be able to fire from this side. Can't sidestep from here. Hmm. All right, we'll relocate her next turn. That's not it. That's actually not that great a spot. Okay. Overwatch. Got it covered. Okay, push Caden over here. And this corner looks clear over here, so I'm actually just gonna move over here with Ulrich. He's got Lone Wolf, so kind of keep him separated from the group. Then next turn I'll maybe move him, say, like right there. Yeah, that seems reasonable ish. Overwatch is fine. And some more Overwatch. Steady weapon. There's gonna be a lot of aliens, and they're gonna be nasty. I hear a cyber disc and mutons, or was it just mutons? All right, raise your hand if you know the answer. <laughs> On it. Hmm. All right, guess we can. We'll go. Move up a bit. Okay. okay, you move back here. I'm on the move. Aye, aye, Commander. Heading to that location. I want to move Mercs. Back, maybe? No, that spot seems okay. Oh, and I'm feeling some coughing coming on. I'll try to cut it out of the audio, but excuse me a second. <coughs> Sorry about that, folks. Hopefully. It wasn't super loud for you. I've been fighting this flu for a while now. I'm hoping it's gonna go away. Apparently the 
particular one I've got lasts like 11 to 14 days. Yeah, good times. Get those flu shots, people. Get those flu shots. Alright, let's see. Let's move up. Uh, hmm. Moving to see if we make contact here with anything. No? Alright, this is starting to get a little peculiar here. We really should have encountered something already. And now what I'm concerned about is... How many things we might encounter at the same time. Yeah, I'm not- I'm not too excited about that potentiality. Moving. Alright, let's move over here. And I'd love to move up and get in there and see if we can maybe get some meld and whatnot, but... It's just Moving. too darn risky. Yeah, it's a cyber disc. Okay. Cyber disc and mutons. So I'm a little bit afraid that there's like cyber disc like kicking it up here. That happens sometimes. All right, let's go take a look this way. Okay. On the move. Knock knock. Got over here. There we go. Now is that just a group or a command pod? It's probably just a group. Yeah, most likely. I'm on the move. Right, let's move Ulrich over. Yeah, he can see him. Let's go ahead and suppress that guy. Copy that. There we go. Now it's shredded. Oh, nice! Okay, let's see if our other sniper has a shot. Yeah. Okay. And what about you? You got a shot? You do. It's not a great one, but... Well, I guess take it. If it hits, it's a kill. Oh, nice! Awesome! Try to get him a little bit of XP, so that's good. Let's see. For that Let's move up here. Provide some Overwatch support from this angle. Rolling Let's out. move Caden up. I guess we can lay some damage into this guy. No reason not to. He's shredded too, so... 11 points, nice. He's gonna regen some of that, but... He's suppressed, so... We're in reasonably good position. Steady weapon back here. Oh, nice! Or we can just kill him. That works. So, what, three sectoids, I think, is what's hiding... ...in the darkness? That's active. Obviously, there's tons of aliens. Oh, okay, there's a Sector Commander there. Alright. Be nice if we could kill him. Anybody he's connected to would die. Oh, here comes another group. What do we got? Mectoid looks like five Sectoids. Okay. Okay. This is looking like a good grenade target. Let's see what's active. We got seven Sectoids, a Mectoid, a Sectoid Commander. Alright. As long as nothing else shows up. We'll, we'll be okay. Hmm. I need to be able to see that mectoid. Should have a shot Welcome. from right here. Mm hmm. Yeah. Okay. This should be fine. So, what we're going to do is we're going to mine merge. Mine merge mercs. Yeah, that'll probably work better, actually. Well, my merge down there gives us some extra crit action. 
Okay, can we just lob a grenade from here? We can. Really just want to destroy this cover. That's the primary thing. So let's go ahead and do that. Well, we destroyed cover for a couple of them. So that's good-ish. Alright, we need to run that overwatch. Let's see. How close do we want to get? I guess I could go here. Yeah, I mean, that mechtoid's not surviving past this round, so it doesn't matter a whole lot. Yeah, alright, so we'll go here and draw the overwatch. 3% chance to be hit. It missed, good. Oh, we got a flank. Exposed targets, yeah, that's nice. Look at that, that's, that's very pretty. Okay, so, we need to shred the mechtoid, because otherwise we're going to have problems. Now, here's where it gets sticky. Because we know we've got a sector commander... Right... Hmm... Well, hold on, is he inside the room? I think he's inside this room, yeah. So actually, I guess we don't have to worry about getting flanked. It doesn't look like it, anyway. Well, we're, we're going to run the risk, because we need to move this away. Yeah, uh, here, here, here. All right, now I need to suppress this guy so that we can apply the shredder effect. And now he's hollow targeted. All right, Hayden, can you move up right here and kind of secure that flank for me? There we go. And let's take a look at our shots here. 84%, 100%, 84%. Well, maybe we should start from the precision shot sniper shots. I think that's probably a better idea. So 66% chance to crit. Uh, that was a 33 critical shot. So, yeah, I think the mechtoid's gonna die. What do you, you, you think, guys? What do, you, what, do you, what are you guys thinking? I'm thinking yes. I'm just, I mean, I'm just, just throwing that out there. It's just a hunch. Copy. 33 crit. That's pretty crazy, right? Set an overwatch. The only downside is I can't really feed the kills to who I want. But, I guess that's okay. Light them up. Gotcha. Goodbye, Mactoid. Well, we brought the right soldiers for starters, and two, um, we got a nice drop. Like, where we ended up. What's your chance to hit that guy? 41? Try to get rid of him. Yeah, our landing zone was 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 pretty pretty sexy. For this map. Let's see. 84, 84. Alright. 100% chance to crit, just need to land the shot. There we go. Nice. And now serving number two. You're out of here. And can we get another one? Maybe. I mean, I don't know. 39? Unlikely. Nope. That's alright, though. It's a pretty good round for us, though, regardless. These sectoids are so tough, though, in terms of trying to hit them. Yeah, they all have low profile, little scumbags, and they have high, like, natural defense to begin with, so... Yeah... It's okay, though. They'll probably fire on the mech, and they can't do too much, really, damage-wise. If they shoot with their pistols, they can crit for a max of 12, but he's got core armoring. Yeah, so, 5 damage, that's fine. Yep, yeah, no biggie. Oh, I didn't realize there was another one. Hi, you little sneaky guy. Okay, he dodged one. That's good. Alright, now let's see if we can't get him some kills. That's what I'd like to do. He has in the zone, so... We could do something like this, where we end up flanking all three. 
Yeah, okay, so 94, 85. Okay, so we'll start the chain with the 94. Then we'll go for the 85 shot. Oh, really? Didn't do enough? Oh, that kind of sucks. I mean, it's okay, but it's kind of unfortunate, right? All right, well, here, let's... Let's relocate, because I, I kind of want to be facing this way. And then suppress this guy. Actually, we could suppress this guy, and that would kill him. Roger that. Suppressing hostile. There we go. I'm out of firepower over here. Because of mayhem, right? We automatically do some damage. All right, and then Moving to position. come over here with Ulrich. Shoot this guy in the face. Got him. Negative ammo. And then reload. Oh, yeah. And what's active? Two sectoids, sectoid commander. Eight aliens killed so far. Not, not bad. Let's go Lock ahead and use this out. as sort of the recovery turn. Move out. Okay, Overwatch. My concern now is where are those cyber discs? That's kind of what I'm. I'm a little, I'm a little worried about them. Cyber discs, especially if there's more than one, are. Ridiculously nasty at this stage, so I'm on the move. Relocate a little bit, reload. And loaded. Actually, I should have reloaded, relocated, and then steady weapon, but it's alright. And there's meld we can get to. See, I think there's just a ton of stuff right in here though. We could do a grenade and try to blow open that wall. The problem is, is that they're not all that great. I mean, we, this is not a, a mech you use for cover destruction, right? So I don't know that that's really viable for us. Yeah, let's go up here and get some heals. I'm not in any rush. We don't have a timer or anything on us. Heading there now. Slide over here, reload. Let's rock. Overwatch. Steady. Steady. Getting it done. Go check this out over here. No? Alright. Heading there now. Okay, let's heal you up, shall we? Rub some dirt on it. There we go, back to full. Nice! Uh-huh. Mutons, are you gonna come join the party now? Noise? Time to kick oh, they are! Alright, well... Oh, there's an elite in there. I saw it. I missed the target. Two elites. Ooh. That's... Mmm... Well, we got a reaction shot, though. That's good. Couple of them. Okay, so we've got a shot here. We can suppress, but I... You know what? I think we're probably better off. We can get this Kim grenade up there. None of them are on Overwatch, right? And I can suppress that guy. 84%, huh? Okay, hold on. Let's do this. Let's... You have a shot from here? Next turn? Maybe. Let's relocate and find out. Yeah, okay, so steady weapon. Come back here. Let's move you up. That's affirmative. Resupply completed. Reload. Moving out. Okay, let's move up here. There we go. Let's suppress you. That'll shred you. 
Keeping him down, Commander. Two at 15. Not worth it. We want to move in. Got it covered. We can. 30, 42. You know what? Let's suppress that guy. Suppressing target. Okay, and then let's get Shit let's get Ulrich over here to help out. Okay, and then let's go ahead and merge. But you can't see? Okay, that's fine. We'll just move over here. Now you should be able to. There we go. Merge right there. Pick up that extra crit. Might actually be able to kill that guy. Maybe. We'll get a crit. No, only seven. Probably should have maybe fired on him first. Yeah, I probably should have. So the question is, do I move forward to say here and lob a chem grenade? I don't think so because the mutant elite's gonna come around, I think, and try to flank. I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna do the safe bet, which is we're gonna take a shot. Okay, missed. Fine, so be it. And then we're actually just going to hunker down. And here comes the cyber disc. Oh, this is... This is not good. And there's multiples. Okay. Alright. They're moving around the side. There's heavy fire in the zone. Do something! I'm pinned down! Oh, jeez. Yeah, this is... This is a little rough here. We're gonna have to pull back. Okay, so first things first, we've got to break these overwatches over here so we can move. Hmm. Why do we want to do this? I could go... Is this wall blown out? Yeah, it, it is. Jeez. Okay. Before we do anything, I want to check sniper shots. Got a shot here. Got a shot here. We have a shot here. We have a shot here. Mm-hmm. Okay. You've got, like, a ridiculous number of shots available. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, let's move Ulrich. Here. Draws the Overwatch. And there'll be another, at least one more Overwatch. Incoming over here. Yep, there it is. Taking fire over here. Alright. Now we can drop a side grenade. Like this. I might do that. We'll see. Um, 100%, 86%, 86%, huh? We may end up taking that shot. Alright. I need that guy dead. The guy that's suppressing is a problem. As is this no cover situation that I have here. 
Hmm. What if... That doesn't help me any. Who can you see? This thing, and you can see him. Alright, I need that guy gone. I need him gone. Like, really, really badly need him gone. So, let's mine merge down here. Okay. Yeah, you move down. Decent hit. Oh, please hit this. Please, 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 please. Oh, man. Yeah, it happened. Get rid of this seeker? That doesn't really help us. I'll take another shot. Oh, yeah! Eliminated. Nice! 26 crit. Okay, that was worth it. That takes care of that problem, which was sort of our initial issue. Okay, and you can see that guy... That guy there. I'm just trying to judge, like, what's the best course of action here. I actually think it's probably just to withdraw. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna withdraw. And I'm gonna hope that the potential line of sight issues are gonna keep the cyberdisc from sort of immediately eating our faces. Yeah, let's get Ulrich out of there. Where can you go, dude? Here? Yes. Well, it's better than nothing, I guess. Okay, moving up, 100 percent, 100 percent, 63 percent, 41 percent. Okay, move here. Get rid of the Seeker. Okay, then we're gonna throw a chem grenade here. Hopefully forces the cyberdisc to go through it, and it'll peel off some of their DR. Nice! At least we got rid of another muton. So this next turn is the critical one. Yeah, you're gonna shoot somebody for a bunch of damage. Well, actually, six is not bad considering what they can do. Mutant Elite's gonna move up. That's so dangerous. Oh, suppressing. It's probably the best deal we could have gotten from that Mutant Elite. And regular Mutant. What are you doing? You're firing, 29%. You missed, good. Fire. It's the Cyberdisc. The Cyberdiscs are the worry here. It's raining death over here. They didn't move because of this. Yeah, most likely. Who are you suppressing? Oh, right. You're suppressing the scout. Because that makes a lot of sense. Let's see. Well, you only got one target, I guess. Hmm. Actually, I'd rather move back. Let's do that. Let's move back. Suppress that drone. Now it's shredded. Should be able to get rid of it. 
like this. There we go. Nice. And then... Let's move back a little bit. Go ahead and reload. Ninety one per cent, sixty four per cent, fifty nine. All right, let's get rid of that drone. There we go. Nice. And our other sniper shot. 52%. Well, we might as well mine merge for the extra crit. If it does hit, should be a kill. Nope. suppress so you can't a vicious cycle all right let's break the suppression you gotta love it when they suppress the one guy that doesn't really have to worry about it it's also give us a little intel on what these cyber discs are doing where'd that other one go that's what I want to know take that shot it's risky because if he doesn't hit it it's bad news but I'm taking the shot. Do it. Yeah. Nice. Dead as disco. Dead as disco. Got another shot there, but I think we will. Yeah, let's move away. I could suppress, but I think I am better off withdrawing. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna withdraw. Reload. And... Yeah, move further back. How far can you go? Well, you can go here and hunker. Okay. So, here's what I'm gonna do, folks. I'm gonna go ahead and end this one here, because it's gotten long enough. And we will continue in the next one. So I hope you've enjoyed this one so far. And if you have, consider hitting that thumbs up. Thanks so much for watching. And until next time, I am Mal. And I will see you later.